Hello everyone, my name is John Paul, daytrade2win.com. In this video, I'm going to focus on the trade scalper. This is software that provides signals on the chart. You learn the method and it's based off of price action. Before we begin, remember that trading is risky. Please do not trade with funds you cannot afford to lose. Talk to your broker and understand the risks involved with trading options, futures, stocks, or forex. There are risks involved with trading. So the trade scalper software can be used on many different types of charts. In today's signals, you can see there are six signals here currently on the chart starting at about 10.45 this morning up until about almost 12 o'clock here Eastern Standard New York time. Out of the six signals, only one of them was a losing trade. All five were winning trades. But now we have a signal at 39.23 quarter, which is actually a signal Order's I'm going to demonstrate filled. to you and take this short for three ticks. I like to use the ATM strategy for a three tick target and I have a six tick stop. So the targets and the stops are predetermined. Three tick target, six tick stop. And I want to see an immediate goal or a profit in my favor. Now the more volatile the market is, the larger the profit. The slower the market is, I would say take three ticks or four ticks of profit. I think that would be the best way to go about it. Now with the Trade Scalper software, you should not be adding any type of moving averages or any type of conventional indicator. It doesn't use any of those things. Target it build. focuses on price action. So pretty quickly here we have a very specific entry, 39.23 quarter, which you learn how these entries are calculated. So even in advance you can understand where the signals are and the stops and the targets can be placed for you almost like a semi-automation the way it works. Now we do offer training with this method. There's a second trade that I'm going to show you that happened right after this one. So I want to show you not just one specific trade here about 11.50 this morning. I also want to show you the follow-up trade. So I'm going to speed up the video. I'm not going to cut the video. I'm going to just speed it up so we can see the very next trade. And by the way, this type of chart is called a two range chart. A two range chart means that every candle, every bar is based on just two ticks or two increments. In this case, we're looking at the E-mini S&P. It's half a point. Um, if you used, for example, a four range chart, every candle would be worth one point or four ticks. So I find that the two range chart under slower conditions works really well. If the market is too volatile or or um, faster moving where these candles are moving so fast that you can't get in or get out in a timely fashion, you do have to increase to a four or a 10 range chart. And I'd also recommend using the primary chart, which is a one minute chart. The one, one minute chart is where most traders are using the trade scalper. But I do wanna show you that it's versatile. You can use a range chart, volume chart, tick chart, and so on. Okay, so here we have uh, the um, market once again giving us another signal. It's going to show up in just a moment. And the signal is very accurate. You're going to place a limit order or a market of touched order, or even if you wanted to use a, a market order is fine. But limit, MIT, or a market order is fine. Remember that market of touched and market orders do have slippage. So if uh, you're worried about slippage, use a limit order. If you're not worried about slippage and you know that it could happen, not all the time, but it could happen, then obviously you shouldn't be uh, too concerned with that. Now the other thing you want to notice is that right now the market isn't moving that fast. It's normal and that's a good thing. We want normal market function. It's a Friday. Typically I say we should not trade uh, beyond one or two o'clock on a Friday because the market slows down. It's not really the same type of environment. The morning is typically the best type of action to trade unless we have higher volatility. So 39.18.50, you can see there on the chart, very specific entry to go short. Order filled. So again, try to get this exact entry. 39.18.50 was exactly the price that I got in as a short trade. I want to have a three tick target and I want to have a six tick stop. And if you get stopped out, there are plenty of other trades that we could make up for it. If you make the target, fantastic, we look for the next trade. And I don't think that after we've seen seven, eight, nine, ten trades, and it's only two and a half hours after the market opens, that's plenty of opportunities to make 
a substantial goal for the day or if you are break even it's time to stop so it's not so much more trades the better it's the accuracy of the trades that really helps so if you've taken for example today Friday um, you've taken 10 trades let's say and you've made eight or nine trades that were profitable with only one or two that were losing trades I would say stop that's an 80 percent accuracy rate you should stop for the day well what about trading different markets can I trade this on the oil or on the soybeans or on the Nasdaq or on the Dow or on coffee absolutely the trade scalper software is universal it could be traded on any market now are you going to trade it on a market that doesn't really move like rice or lumber I would say no you have to have a market that actually moves and you want to have some normal activity for example a five minute chart works great when the market is more volatile or even a one minute chart when the market is slow or it's normal a two range chart a tick chart because you have enough time to enter and exit the other thing that I recommend is using and automating the stops and the targets it's so much easier when the market is moving in a normal fashion and then the targets and stops are placed for you you can adjust them and then you don't have to manually place the targets and the stops and ninja trader does that for you it can actually have a template where you say I want three or four ticks of target or stop and it places them for you so it really does make it a lot easier to get in to the trade and get out of the trade because all you have to do is just click enter as a buyer or as a seller the other thing about the trade scalper software is that it is available as a lifetime license especially for those of you who joined the mentorship program we have all the software available with a lifetime license now as we move forward in time the one thing that concerns me is that I don't want a trade like this to last for half hour target or, filled. or 40 minutes and so we should have the target met within a certain amount of time so in this example here between 1208 and 1211 we're talking about seven minutes seven eight minutes uh, six minutes even so when I look at the amount of time that it takes for the trade to produce the profit that I'm expecting the sooner it happens the better or else there's no reason to hang on to the trade if you have any questions email us if you're new to day trading and want to learn more on the benefits of trading the markets visit daytrade2win.com Join the next mentorship class starting later this month and subscribe to the Day Trade to Win YouTube channel. We focus on price action and we work exclusively with new and beginner traders who want to learn more on how to prosper from trading.